Hello and welcome to another Quattro Tech Cars video. Today we have this 66 plate Audi A4 Avant. As you can see, it looks absolutely phenomenal with this car. So it's the S-Line specification. However, you've got the 19 inch V-spoke design alloys, which we've just had all four professionally refurbished and sprayed in that anthracite gray. This particular A4 is powered by the three liter V6 TDI diesel engine, which puts out 272 PS. So it's the higher um, output of the two and it's driven by the Tiptronic automatic gearbox. It's got a really nice specification as well. We've also had the rear privacy glass added just to make this car really stand out. Let's have a look at more of the detail inside. Okay, so here we are round at the boot of the A4. As you can see, the previous owners got this rubber load liner in. Underneath that, you can see the boot floor in a really nice condition. Um, generally, it's a sign that the car's been well looked after if owners are willing to put these sorts of things in as protection. We've got two ice weeks anchoring points there for kids seats, that really useful ambient lighting for loading things in the dark. You've got various luggage hooks there as well, and the rear seat release levers, which will push the rear seats forward without you having to go into the back. We've also got a 12 volt power socket charging any ancillaries down there. And just underneath the boot floor, there's a space saver spare wheel. We've also got the electric tailgate on the A4 vans of this age, which is a really nice bit of kit to have, especially if you've got a shopping or kids or something like that. You can even open the boot from the key as well. We've got Audi's parking system plus the front and rear sensors, which are integrated into the rear bumpers there, which come up on the main display. There's awesome LED rear lights. And then coming in to the interior, we've got Alcantara door cards, the S-Line brushed aluminium inlays. And what's really nice about this car is that we've got a full leather interior. So you've got the contrast stitching there. It's in very nice condition. There are no rips, tears, stains, or any odors. We've got three zone climate control there as well, and a 12 volt power socket for the passengers. And then as with all S lines, you've got that nice black headline in there. So it feels really luxurious and classy inside. Coming round to the front, we've got electrically heated and electric adjustable door mirrors. We've also got the comfort and sound pack on this A4. So that gives you the fantastic Bang Olufsen speaker system. So much more powerful than standard. It's also upgraded with the technology pack as well in terms of the overall power and the wattage. Um, really phenomenal clarity, depth and bass as well. We've got the electric front seats also, which is part of that pack and the four-way lumbar adjustment and support just there. So you really can get that perfect driving position with these full leather electric seats. Coming into the driver's seat, we've got automatic LED headlights with LED daytime running lights. This also includes a light and rain sensor as well. So you can adjust the sensitivity on this dial just here. And then we've got the auto dimming rear view mirror there. If we come back round to the steering wheel, we've got a perforated leather multifunctional unit with a number of controls just there, which will control the driver information system. And on the right hand side here, we've got volume, mute, we've got track selection as well. And then we've got some more audio buttons. So we've got the voice recognition, you can answer and decline telephone calls with that one, repeat navigational commands, and then we've got the asterisk button there, um, which will uh, be programmable to a number of different things of your choosing. We've got the cruise control on that separate stalk just down there below the indicator. And being the automatic Tiptronic, we've got the up and down shift paddles as well for the gear change. Moving over to the main screen. So because it's got the technology pack as well, this car, you get the wider uh, screen just here with a higher resolution. It also is a bit faster as well. And the navigation, as we can see just here, is um, directly in the hard drive as opposed to SD base. So it all just works a bit faster. You can still obviously connect your phone wirelessly via the Bluetooth to make and receive calls. You can do the same for the media, so you can listen to all your favourite songs wirelessly. However, you do also have um, a combination of AUX, USB slots, SD and CD slots in the glove box as well. The AUX and the USB are just underneath the centre console just here. Um, and then you've also got the wireless charging as well as part of that technology pack. Um, as well with that, what's interesting to note is the keys themselves, just here, you've also got the advanced key uh, just there, which gives you a few good features, including um, touch locking um, and opening of the doors, which I'll show you in just a second. Coming back round to the main screen, 
you can see that the menu A looks really nice. It's really easy to follow. Um, if we go into car here, we've got the drive select. So the different modes of the vehicle when you're driving along, which you can change from efficiency to comfort, auto, dynamic, and individual. This will change things, including the weight and feel of the steering, the throttle response, and how the car changes gear as well. Of course, this A4 is also Quattro four wheel drive. So it's got Audi's world famous four wheel drive system, um, which gives you fantastic security and grip um, right the way throughout the year on all sorts of different surfaces and conditions. We've also got the parking sensors. So they will come on automatically when you go into reverse, but if you press this button, you can see that small window pop up just there with the sensors just there. And then if we scroll down to the Audi smartphone interface, you can plug your iOS or Android device in via the USB take advantage of Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. This will enable you to use apps like um, Google Maps, Apple Maps, WhatsApp, Spotify, Apple Music, Tidal, um, all of your podcast apps as well, your phone and messaging apps, which is mainly controlled by the voice activation. Um, so what it does is it basically throws up a version of your phone's iOS and menu screen up onto the A4 screen just here. It all updates with your phone, so it should stay really fresh and current. Um, it does use the data as it has a data connection, uh, but the great thing is, is that you have two completely different options of how all of the navigation and things like that would work um, as opposed to the car's iOS that we've got at the moment um, or your phone. So that's a really great bit of kit. Um, so like I said, you just need the appropriate data cable and plug it in, plugging it in through the USB. Moving further down, we've got the dual zone climate control with the heated front seat, which is a really nice option to have as well, especially with the leather and us being in these colder months. So we've got three levels of control just there. You've got haptic touch buttons just along here as well. So it all feels really high quality. We've got the drive select, um, quick selector just here so that you can use on the go. Start, stop, which you can deactivate, the traction control, parking sensors. And with this button here, you can even turn the screen off. There's an extra 12 volt power socket down there for charging ancillaries. We've got the ignition on off because obviously it's all keyless. Some nice ambient lighting, as well as having the ambient lighting in those B&O speakers as well. All of the multimedia interface just here with these programmable touch buttons for various different things, including um, radio uh, communications uh, in terms of phone numbers, like a speed dial, or you can have a navigational um, point set in there. So really, really useful. And actually, this part in here is also a touchpad. So you can just write in your postcode or the number that you're trying to call someone. So really, really cool feature there. We've got the Tiptronic gearbox here with sport and manual mode. Um, we've got a volume selector and a uh, volume dial and track selector, sorry. And then we've got the electromechanical parking brake as well. So as you can see, the A4 really, really well specified this car. We'll also be giving it a service as well. And we're doing a full check over, including a new MOT. All Quattro Tech cars also come with six month warranty, including six months roadside assistance. Please don't hesitate to get in touch with us so we can explain how we're currently facilitating safe and socially distant test drives and appointments. Thank you very much.